Hello everyone. In today's session, we are going to have an introduction about what is parsing, what is parsing algorithms and all. Uh, we know what is parser, right? Like we take a grammar, something like this: e tends to e plus e, e star e, and slash id. See, whenever uh, expression is there, like it is an infix expression. If I want to write an inf infix expression, it is written like this: id plus id or id star id and all. Okay. So operator is allowed in between of two identifiers. And how you draw a parse tree? starts from e, e you can write e as e plus e and e is e derives id and e derives id okay so this is the general notations so parsing is the pro, uh, is the process of taking an input and comparing with the, the context free grammar and deriving this parse tree okay and it is not like we take uh, on my own and do it okay there should be an algorithm that is going to do this process okay so that is called parsing so parsing is the process or a algorithm that is going to take your input and check whether this input is in the proper syntactic structure as expressed in terms of your context free grammar context free grammar is used to represent the syntactic structure of anything like a programming language or a normal grammatical structure of your natural language or anything okay so when there exists a context free grammar and if a uh, input is also given we have to compare it and verify whether the input is in the proper syntactic structure or not the base of your compiler works like this okay so for each and every programming uh, syntax like when i have a c program for each and every statement like a identifier or a declarative statement assignment statement or a if then else statement everything has its own syntactic structure and when a user write a program there is a parser that parser is going to verify whether the program written by the user is in term is in proper syntactic structure or not okay so this process is called parsing and there are two types of parser in general like you have a universal parser uh, in general we just speak about a top down parser and bottom up parser okay top down parser is something uh, that parses in the structure it it takes a grammar starts from the starting symbol derives your input okay so this is one way of parsing derivation and this called top down parser parsing and there is something called bottom up parser that starts from input and reduces it to your starting symbol okay so this is called bottom up parsing okay so top down parsing starts from the starting symbol derives its input whereas bottom up parser starts from the input and it reduces to the starting symbol okay so this is the difference between top down and bottom up parser and remember the terms here derivation is for top down parsing deriving the input and reduction is for bottom up parsing from the input we are going to reduce it to the starting symbol okay this is called reduction process okay thank you